My reaction about my sister being chosen for the bachelorette made me quite happy, but also a little bit anxious about what guys should be meeting and whether any of them would be good enough for her. My advice to Kunisa when she joined the bachelorette was, dear baby, be a good listener. Listen, because if you listen very well, you'll hear in between the sentences that are being said, who not to give the rose and who to give the rose. And it will all be about listening. I just told her to be herself. Um, be as genuine as possible. And knowing her, I just said to myself that if she presents herself as who she is, then she'll just get the perfect fit for her. And I think she, she's really done that. What I really appreciate is the growth that she's gone through being on the bachelorette and I think that has been amazing for me to see. My fondest memory of her as a child, it was her birthday and a cake was brought for her. It was a very nice artistic cake. It was like a log cake. And she came home, looked at the cake and she broke down crying and she said, no ways am I taking this ugly, mud looking like cake to school. I need a better looking cake. So there I was, the birthday was the next day. I had to go and pick and pay. Mind you, the cake, I had paid a lot for the designer kind of cake. I had to go to pick and pay, look at the most colorful, pinky, bluish cake. And I go and look for little dolls and I put the dolls on the cake. And I came home, she said, this is the perfect, perfect cake. And then she sat down and gobbled away the brown chocolate cake. <laughs> she, she laughed it. <laughs> That's good news for you. It's important for us to meet the guys um, while, of course, we will not tell her, you know, you can't be with this person or if she brings someone home and we're like, sorry, this person can't come around again. It's important for us, for our own um, peace of mind to know who she might be potentially bringing home, especially from a situation where she's had to pick from a whole range of guys on a, on a TV show. So we wanted to know that the person was real and it wasn't just some person, you know, a chance taker. We wanted to see that it's a person that actually cares about her and not just how she looks, but who she is as a, as a person. There's life beyond the camera. <laughs> There's life beyond all of this. And it's important that we try and know the kind of person that we might bring into our family as we're a close-knit family. We do a lot of things together. We're a very open family. So it, it, it really was more of giving us a sense of type of person and also a sense of security for her to say, okay, she's with someone that she really likes, that um, really understands who she is, what type of family she comes from, and also for us to have a glimpse of what that person's family might be because you know it's not like we'll just be sharing him with us us only it's gonna be vice versa you know we'll obviously want to know his family also so at least that gave us you know some sense of a feel of what we're dealing with yeah it was very important for me to see the two guys that she has shortlisted and um i think the issue is all my kids i've met all their boyfriends and girlfriends if she decides who it is that person has to fit into the family. We go on holidays together. We sit and have fun, take pictures and do all sorts of things. So that person has to be really a part of our family.